In this video, we are going to see how to install MySQL on Red Hat Linux operating system. I have divided this installation into 5 steps. In the step 1, we are going to configure MySQL M repository. In the second step, we are going to install MySQL. In the third step, we are going to start the MySQL server. In the fourth step, we will verify the MySQL server service status. In the fifth step, we are going to connect to MySQL server. I have connected to my Red Hat Linux operating system. Run whatever the commands I am going to run in the terminal. Those will be available in the video description. See, I have executed this M repository command. Press Y. So, as of now, we have installed M repository. Now, we are going to verify M repository added or not. So, it has been added. See, this is the community server. Now, we are going to install MySQL on Red Hat Linux operating system. We can install Red Hat Linux operating system by using the command. I am going to clear the screen. m install mysql hyphen community iphone server. Notice here it has it is going to download. 441 MB size of the software. Press Y to start the download. So, download has been completed and press Y to start the installation of MySQL server. Notice here it is installing MySQL server components, client, common libraries and MySQL server. So, installation has been completed successfully. Now, we are going to start the MySQL server by using the command service MySQL D start. As mentioned in the fourth step, we have started the MySQL server. Now, we are going to verify whether MySQL server has been started or not by running the command service MySQL D status. Notice here status is active and running. Now, we are going to connect to the MySQL server. I am going to clean the screen. MySQL hyphen u, u means username, default user is root p. 
also it is not accepting. For that, we have to get temporary password for the root user. To get the temporary password, run this command. See, this is the temporary password for my, for my server. MySQL hyphen u root hyphen p. Copy this password and paste here. So, we have connected to MySQL server with the temporary password. Immediately, you have to change the password of root user by using the command alter user root at the root localhost identified by with a password whatever you like. Give the more complicated password. Alter user root at the rate local host identified by so we have changed the password of root user to effect the changes immediately we have to run the command flash privileges so changes has been affected exit and try with new password so in this video we have covered add repository then install the mysql then we have started the mysql server then we have verified the mysql server status in the last step we have connected to the mysql server but we failed with the password then we get the temporary password then we have reset the root password of mysql server for more updates related to mysql and postgresql server dba as well as developer videos please subscribe my channel thank you